questions from Saad Youssef. Saad? As uh, I know you guys get to go against him every day in practice, but what, what do you see from Joe Pavelski every day that allows him to be as efficient as he is at this age? Oh, well, he's a big time competitor. Um, I like actually playing against him in practice and because I feel they're a really, really good line. And, you know, back in the days when he was in San Jose, he was kind of trouble every night to play against him. He's such a good grind around the net front. So it's always a tough battle against him. So we're lucky to have him in our team. Next, we'll go to Mike Heike. Mike? Hey, yeah, so you guys have had different challenges since returning from the break. Uh, how do you feel about the team's game right now? It seems like you guys are, are starting to click. Yeah, I, I've felt we are playing how we played those couple of last games before the break. And um, I think the, it's a good feeling around the team. And uh, even though the game we lost in St. Louis, we played, played pretty well. So... Uh, win tonight, and I think everyone's feeling good, and that's just got to do the same on the road. Next, we'll go to Matt DeFrance. Matt? Yes, I know it sounds simple, but why are you guys so good at home? That's a good question. I think, uh, like today, we came out hard, and we took the, took the game against them, and we went after them, so... I think that's been a really good thing for our team. That's something we haven't had on the road, and that's something everyone spoke, spoke in the locker room and coaches has brought it up. So we should be able to do the same on the road, what we've done on, at the home. Saad Yusuf, go ahead. Essa, do you guys do you guys go out there with each penalty kill with with the same attitude, or do you guys have different missions depending on what penalty kill, where in the game, and and who's on the kill? Uh, I would say it's the same mission all the time. It only depends if they're it's their first or kind of second unit and how they play, kind of. So same mission, play hard, try to get clears, make them do breakouts, which kind of frustra frustrates them and that way it kills the clock. Next, we'll go to Sam Nessler. Sam? Essa, how great is it to see Tanner Carroll back out on the ice after the injury that he went through? Oh, it's great, obviously. It's been good to see him on the ice with us when he practice and now to see him playing, he, so we're all all happy to have him here, and he was lucky that he wasn't anything bigger on that collision. And finally, we'll go to Matt DeFranks. Matt, on your assist, did you know you're going to have that much space even before you got the puck? Uh yeah. I had a little time to check it because uh, I think it was a bad backhand rim from their guy. So, and also their guy changed. So, I had quite plenty of time to get my head up and yeah, play there. With your hand function. I will call on you. Saad Yusuf, go ahead. Rope, obviously, you playing with Joe for a while now. What what allows him to be as successful for him to have his first five point night of his NHL career today? Uh, I mean everyone knows how kid kid of player he is. And uh, I think he's been doing that every game this year and every year when he plays. But uh today just everything clicked, I think he was around the net a lot and uh, I think he deserved that today. Next we'll go to Mike Heika. Mike Hey, Rope, did you go over and try and get the puck for him? And were you aware of this, you know, earlier in the game that five points would be a pretty big game for him? Uh, of course, that's, that's a, like, really good game for him. And, and in the end, we were trying to trying to look at their goal for him, too, because it was 5-2 and a minute left. So we were trying to look at that there, too. 
Matt DeFranks, go ahead. Rope, how'd you feel about your guys' four check? It seemed like it was difficult for them to get out of their own end tonight. Yeah, I think we four checked today really well. I think at least those first two periods, we were all over them all, all, the, all the time. And uh, I think that was really hard for them to break out because we were, someone was all, all the time all on them. So I think we just have to keep playing like that. Sam Nessler, go ahead. Rope, the offense is obviously the big story tonight, but how did you guys find success in keeping Seattle's offense from getting uh, quality scoring chances against? Uh, I think we just have to have to play play smart in the neutral zone. There's lots of teams and are like really good rush teams, so we just have to take that away from them and try to play like a smart smart hockey and get it deep and get it out in our blue line. So I think that's that's the biggest thing. And finally, we'll go to Saad Yusuf. So, Robe, you guys have done this pretty consistently at home. How do you how do you kind of take this kind of momentum and uh, and do it on the road? Yeah, I think we had we had a pretty good game in, in St. Louis uh, last road game we had. So I think we just have to play like that on the road how we played played the last game and now how we've been playing at home. So we just have to have to find a way to play the same same way on the road that we play here. All right, thank you, Robe.